Hello, my name is Dr. Marianne D. Eduardo. I have been teaching for VIP Kid for two years. My favorite student story is about Tony. I sent Tony via mail a card. The type of card that I mailed to China was a three-dimensional card similar to this card. The card opens into a beautiful artwork. Tony showed me the card during one of our classes when he received it. It was such a wonderful moment when he thanked me in English for a greeting card that was to thank him for coming to my classes. I am a poet. The poems that I write are about experiences that I have. This experience is about horses. I visited horses on a local farm and I wrote this poem. Like the Snow by Marianne D. Eduardo. Snow breezes by as Appaloosa patterns pick up the natural cresting death life cycle. Hear the swift horses moving past our dreams into visions of light that show us how to live rocks. Rocks fly, Appaloosa dies. When the first died out of hatred, the mystical herd bonded and flew into spiritual peace where they still lie bound. By one thought to save others, the rocks became spots and the snow, the peace of motherly love. This poem is published in my book, Appaloosa Dreams. Poetry is so important. It brings us close to feelings. Words have feelings. So when I wrote this poem, I was feeling close. I have another short poem on hope. This poem is haiku. As Appaloosa patterns pick up the natural cresting death life cycle. When I write poetry, I think about my experiences. Sometimes I like to write about trees. Sometimes I write about horses or natural settings. I also like to keep journals, which are short explanations of studies. This journal is about a forest. There are parts to a forest. The canopy is named after the definition of a tropical rainforest structure. Soaring. As you find wildlife in forests, you can see the birds soaring. Hills. The three-dimensional visions that I see in my art are about using hills to draw. I like to draw with my students and I often show them hills. This hill is in watercolor. I also like to talk about pandas and I draw small creations to explain words such as summer. It was very nice sharing poetry and stories with you today. Thank you so much.